Hey everybody, it's Tom Bullington here with Hastings Happenings. Hope you're doing great today and enjoyed your Thanksgiving. Uh, I know a lot of us were out for Small Business Saturday today in downtown Hastings and for the holiday hoopla and all those good times. So thank you to everyone who was involved in putting that together. You did a great job, um, as well as Gobblegate on Thursday morning. Uh, Hastings is just the hip happening place to be this week and this weekend. So thank you to everyone who's involved in that. Downtown Business Association, all the business owners. Uh, we had the, the holiday tree lighting this evening with uh, Mayor Fassbender and just a lot of fun, family-focused things happening here this weekend in Hastings. So good to see that. Wanted to give you an update on what's happening with uh, the city of Hastings, and they send out a weekly update. So this is kind of the video component of that. Uh, truth and taxation hearing. <laughs> Enough of the fun. We're going to get right to the truth and taxation hearing is December 5th. And that's Monday night at seven o'clock um, during the city's regular city council meeting. The public is invited to attend and participate in the hearing. If you have questions about you probably received something in the mail saying what your property taxes are going to be for 2023. Uh, the budget and the tax levy are going to be discussed and approved possibly um, on the uh, on the 5th of December. So that's the initial hearing. Um, if you would like more information, the city website, hastingsmn.org is there for you. So you can preview the truth and taxation hearing on December 5th. It's everyone's favorite meeting. Uh, but if you have any questions about that, I would encourage you to reach out to your council member as well prior to that meeting and let him or her know what you think. Um, fire safety is very important during the holidays. And a lot of times we're burning candles. We have lights on our trees. Uh, we are plugging in multiple electronics, charging things like this, and having the heater on and having space heaters and furnace all sorts of ways to uh, catch things on fire, unfortunately. So the Hastings Fire Department is encouraged everyone to be very vigilant around electronics, around fires, things like that, burning a fire in your fireplace, etc. cetera. Um, there is a large wreath on the fire station with all white lights. Uh, the wreath will stay in place from Thanksgiving until January 1st uh, for every preventable structure fire with the response area of the Hastings uh, Fire Department, they're gonna put a white bulb, uh, replace, it, replace it with a red bulb, which means there is a fire. And the goal ultimately is to have as many white lights remain on that wreath uh, until January 1st. So if we continue to make it all white for the rest of the year, that would be wonderful. Um, check out the, the wreath on uh, the fire department and thanks to Pat Moen Lawn Care for, uh, for providing the wreath to the fire department. City Council uh, on November 21st was a uh, first reading of an ordinance to approve the new Arts and Culture Commission in the city of Hastings. Good job, guys. Glad you got that done. Um, and then also approved a variance to the city code to allow a monument sign to be placed at the Confluence Project. That's going to be opening in the spring, so more information about that is to come, I'm sure. Uh, I'm sorry, January. Uh, Saturday, December 1st through the 11th is the candy cane hunt in city parks. Now, the candy canes are hidden in five Hastings parks. Use the five clues to locate in which parks the candy canes are hidden. Each candy cane will have a letter attached. Write down this letter or take a picture. Don't take the candy cane with you. At the end of your hunt, you would have five letters to unscramble a word. The hunt can be walked on the trails and would take an hour and a half to complete if driving the hunt takes about 30 minutes. Um, email your unscrambled word and or pictures to parksinfo at hastingsmn.gov and prize information will follow you once you submit your email. And I'm looking at this, and the clues are all on the city website. If you go to under events, it'll say candy cane hunt, um, and then it will say, um, it will give you all the details I just went over, and then it has the five clues right here. Um, 
on the city website, hastingsmn.gov. Go to events under communications and you'll see all of the um, all of the good um, clues for for finding the candy canes. Unscramble that word, send it to parksinfo at hastingsmn.gov and you have got um, a prize. So that'll be that'll be great. And the prize information is TBD. It's going to be a secret um, until you send in send in the the word. So the next big meeting happening Tuesday, Parks and Recreation Commission convenes at seven o'clock. For more information on that, you can go to the website as well, hastingsmn.gov. If you have any questions for uh, the city of Hastings, get in, get a hold of them either online. Um, at hastingsmn.gov, or you can call them at 651-480-2350. They are open from 8 o'clock till 4.30, Monday through Friday, uh, when there's not a holiday. Again, if you have any questions for the city of Hastings, get in touch with them. Again, signing off for Hastings Happenings, Tom Bullington here, and have a great week. Bye.